we're in our new car. While we're waiting, we wanted to show you how excited we are about it and show you some of the fun features of it. Anyway, so here you go. Roll the intro. Okay, so we're going to start right here at the steering wheel. <laughs> we did a cheap uh, hybrid car. It's not cheap, actually. But anyway, is it's a Honda Sonata hybrid. And um, so here we go. So basically, this right here is for the radio. Um, let's see. I'll turn it down. How about that? Okay, so if I hit the mode, it, let's see, it changes the radio thing. Um, we have XM for three months and we've kind of, and then this up and down, we'll kind of choose, you know, which, uh, station right Kiss there. <clears throat> and then the other thing is ob obviously the volume. We all know what that is. Anyway, so when you call, you can actually use this as a voice. Um, and when you have everything synced on Bluetooth, uh, we can have up to five contacts. Each contact can have over, I think, knock it off, have a thousand contacts. Whoa. And so I can look them up by that. Um, it shows me my call history. Anyway, so that's kind of fun. We don't need to show them other people's numbers. That's not okay. So anyways, that's, you can answer and up here above my head is the speaker for that. You can see it right here. So that's something, a feature that we've never had before. So it's kind of fun. Um, anyway, we've got also the radio, which is the same as pushing the, the mode on the steering wheel. You just keep continuing. Media is what is Bluetooth audio, which is on my phone. Um, obviously mute and fun stuff there. Um, okay, so back to the steering wheel. We're done with this side. This is an important feature for me, <laughs> knowing where the horn is. <laughs> Anyways, and then we've got cruise control and this display button shows what's going on up here. And so, yeah, that just kind of scrolls through here. Right now we're at 39. What did it say? I don't know what that means. Trip A, trip B, we got 439 miles that we have put on the car ourselves. Um, oh, the cool feature that is on this one is this right here, the energy flow. When we're driving, you can actually see um, which direction everything is coming, whether it's coming from the battery to the tires or uh, from the tires the battery. to the battery, which charges this, this will go up. Or the engine um, to the battery to the tires. Yeah, so, or the engine. It'll show you where the, where the energy is coming from. So that's kind of a cool feature to watch when we're driving. Obviously not while we're driving, but it's a cool feature to have. Um, not really anything too fancy right here. Uh, the one cool thing I like is the gear shift. So do you see this in here? It's an automatic, but it's also a standard. So if I get it into drive, I can just pull the gear shifter over and then I can shift up and down and it shows instead of park, reverse, neutral and drive, do not touch that. It will say one, two, three, four, five, and six. And I can shift between those. So we've had that with another car before and, and it's a fun feature as well. Uh, we've got the, the traction, um, which is really handy. And of course our lighting um, with that and then our gas, our trunk, and then the door. Of course you got y'all all, all the, the normal features, nothing fancy. Uh, the one thing I am excited about is this is, I don't like the electric seats. I like to be able to raise and drop with that. That's I like that. Oh, the other thing that we haven't, we have a little compartment in here. Um, no, I don't know. And that's a cool, I like that little compartment. compartment. We've got two chargers, an aux, and a USB. Uh, and then of course my key does not go in the ignition. It's one of these deals. So the thing is, is the trick is to have your foot on the brake when you start it. Let's turn it off. Um, to start it, you can't just touch it. You see the red light? 
it won't just start. So you have to have the brake on. And it sings to me even. And it's on. You can't hear it because it is the hybrid. It's the electric. Uh, that's our key. That's our key. Anyway, we have so an extra key. the other fun thing is, yeah, the other fun thing is right here with the, the dual this is fun, something that we haven't really had before. Stop kicking my seat. Uh, and then we've got heaters. We've got cup holders. A couple of little compartments. So we have this one. Oh, bonk. And then we have another one right below it. Here's the cool thing. Is if my battery on my key was to be out, there's a little pocket in here that what I basically heck? plug that That's into. Oh, did I? Oh, I just put it in there instead until I can get, get the battery replaced. So I can still push the button, but not have to um, do anything else. Anyway, so we've got side airbags, front airbags, of course, it's a new car. And there's one um, right there's here and right here. Your sunglass holder. Oh, hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anyway, so let's let's not too not too many fancy things back there. Not too shabby. But let's go outside and see the outside. One is our little compartment right here. Great for cell phones. You pop that in there. And right here. There, and there's this that. thing. Okay, so let's go look at the outside. So yeah, it's a blue. Anyway, so don't sit on it. Get off the car. <laughs> we'll just... I have the headlights on automatic. On an automatic. Anyway, so here's here's the car. Put your stop. Off. Uh, one of the fun things. Oh, you just tapped. It's a swimming bag. No, we have a cargo net. Uh, when we don't move, please. When we don't, uh, let's say we kill the battery. This is where we would charge our battery. Is in the trunk. If I can even get it off. Don't break it. I won't. I might. Uh, there's our battery in the Whoa. back to charge it if we were ever to kill it. That's cool. Um, there's little compartments back there. Wait, is that literally our battery that we're using right now? Yeah. Um, actually, I think it goes underneath the car, but there is a little pocket that if you need to put you something like through there, there like, and go into the trunk with, you could. Oh, you or you could fit a child in there. No children in the trunk, that's illegal. Uh, cup holders in the back. Oh! And then, of course, pull down that middle slot. We're going to fill the, the seats with kids, but if we only have two, there's an armrest with cup holders, which is pretty fancy. and. If you open, you can open this thing in the back if you need Whoa, to. Whoa, how do you do this? Of course, you got pockets. How do you do it, Mom? Uh, <laughs> anyway, so that's basically. Good day. Oh, this is the one last feature. So, if I do or don't have my, if I have my keys in my pocket, I don't need to pull them out and use the key holder. I can push this once to open mine, twice. To open all of the doors and if I leave my keys Ember. in the car Ember. if I leave the keys Ember. in the car and I try to lock it or if I tr yeah it won't lock you yeah, opened up the, the, the thing there anyway so the one thing I did not tell you was that if you're taking keys and you leave them in the car and you try to lock it um, hit the lock button you can't it won't let you lock it unless the keys are out of the car um, so that's a good feature. So you're not going to accidentally lock your keys feature. in the car. I know another feature. What? If if you try to lock your trunk and your keys are in the trunk, then the trunk will just automatically open. Yeah. Same thing with the car. So it's not going to let you. Can I go show them? Anyway, so glad uh, we have a new car. It's something we've needed. Can I show them? Comment down below. Share, like, and thank you for subscribing. Don't, if you haven't already, don't do it. it yet. Don't press it yet.